it's Betsy and today we have a fun video. I'm gonna go over what I got for Christmas 2020. Now before we jump into this video I want to preface this by saying now I know what I got is excessive. My love language is gift giving and gift receiving. So we go big for holidays. We go big for birthdays, for Christmas, that type of thing. And this is not a video to brag over what I got, but to brag over my family because they are absolutely amazing. So the first thing we're gonna jump into is I'm gonna post a picture, not of me in it, but of my first gift I received, which is a gift from my daughter, Nadia. She bought this back in October whenever Skims released their velour collection, and it is the long velour robe. She couldn't wait to give it to me till Christmas, and I wear it all the time. It is absolutely stunning. It is the perfect length. I love that thing. It's amazing. So that's the first gift. Now, the second gift I received, now this is pretty priceless to me. My mother-in-law purchased me one of the Thomas Kincaid prints. I'm gonna try not to blind you, but it is the Beauty and the Beast print of them dancing at night. And one of the thing I love about the Thomas Kincaid prints is it does have different things like the dog stool, there's Maurice, there's Cogsworth, you can see Gaston in the background, but you have to look at these very closely because there's always so much going on with it. And I think it's absolutely stunning. She had it framed here locally at the Nederland frame shop. And then the certificate of authenticity is on the back. So I'm super duper excited for this because if you're not aware, I am a Disney freak. I love everything Disney. And I have three main favorite characters. Belle from Beauty and the Beast is always going to be my number one princess because she is a bookworm like I am and she is like my main Disney princess. Then Tinkerbell will always love the little green fairy. She is my favorite. There's nothing that tops her. And last but not least is Eeyore. I love Eeyore. There's something about Eeyore. Eeyore is my spirit animal. I have so many things that are Eeyore and this was extremely important to me because I do collect Disney things and I do collect Disney artwork. And I'm super happy to have this in my collection. My husband is coming by after he gets off work so we can hang it up here at my shop studio because I spend more time here than I do anywhere else so it makes sense to have it hanging here. Next up is a gift from my sister-in-law. And now she had special ordered this because some people go and shop in the Disney parks and it is the Christmas 2020 Minnie and Mickey popcorn bucket. Now these are awesome. Uh, we have the alien one. As I said, I collect Disney items and this is a really cool piece to have uh, for a collector because they only I had to close it for you and I didn't want to break it but this is what it looks like. I typically will remove the straps off of them and store it in there. And I decorate at Christmas with these. I have like the alien one and I love them. I use them to hold candy or whatever else. So whenever you pull the straps off. Um, but I was bummed that we didn't get to make our annual Disney trip this year. So uh, she ordered this and was able to get it and she was so excited. And so am I because I absolutely love this thing. I love that it has more of that vintage Christmas tree kind of feel to it. So I'm super happy to have this added to my collection. And I have done room tours and you will always see that there is a ton of Disney stuff because again, I love Disney. Okay, then my mother-in-law also purchased me this sweater from one of the local boutiques. Isn't that adorable? Hopefully I don't stain it, but it is gorgeous. I love the light pink color and I think it'll be very flattering on my skin tone, but yeah, it's cute. And it's Hem and Thread is the brand. But yeah, it's what she looks like. It's just a long comfy sweater, which is something I like. I dress up, but not like, a lot of times when you see me, I'm wearing a t-shirt, I wear fancier jewelry because I'm filming, but that's about it. 
Okay, I have a box next to me. Next up is two things that Nadia purchased for me. She bought me the YSL or Yi Saint Laurent Touche Eclat 3D All Over Glow Highlighter. The packaging looks like this. Isn't that beautiful? Oh, and then that, I didn't know that that lifts up. So there is a little brush underneath and then the highlight looks like this. We'll go ahead and swatch it. I cannot wait to play with this. Oh, that is pretty. It's not like a super bam in your face kind of glow, but it is a beautiful natural glow. And if you see me looking down, I'm looking at the monitor trying to make sure you, oh yeah, you can definitely see that. That is pretty. I cannot wait to get that on my face. So she got me that, and then she also purchased me the Yves Saint Laurent. This is a little lip set that has, she purchased me a while back one of the larger lip balms from Yves Saint Laurent, but this has a mini lip balm, a mini lipstick, and then a mini liquid lipstick. And they're in like a pink nudie kind of color. So I'm excited to play with that. Um, because I wear nude lips more than anything like y'all don't I mean well yeah y'all y'all see me all the time but or if you watch me you know okay we're gonna save the big big for last um go ahead and grab these okay so I collect Pandora charms especially Pandora Disney charms if you do not know um I get a new charm pretty much any time we go to the Disney parks. And then I have a lot that my husband and the kids have given me. So this year for Christmas, my husband bought me, let's see if it'll focus. This is the baby Yoda charm. There we go. Art Grogu, so cute. Cannot wait to get that on my bracelet. So we have that one. Cameron, or no, this is one from Caden. This is so cute too. Let's see if I can open it up because it's still in the plastic bag. Caden is obsessed with Star Wars and he got me the BBA charm and the head does actually turn. Isn't that cool? So cute. So I got that. And then last but not least, Cameron for my Christmas gift got me the Baby Stitch. Which Stitch is his absolute favorite character. Stitch is his spirit animal. So I cannot wait to get those on my charm bracelets. I literally have two Pandora charm bracelets because I have so many charms from my family. Okay, next up is one that I'm super excited about. This is Tom Ford, the perfume, which is, it's called, I'm not going to say the full name because I don't want to get demonetized, is Effing Fabulous. So when you open her up, this is an expensive perfume even for this size. It has the atomizer that looks like this. And then it's got a really nice, to me, it's a very clean kind of scent. And it is a unisex fragrance, so this would work for a man or a woman. And then this little bottle, the little thing comes out and then it slides in here. And then what's great about this for carrying it in your purse, you can hear that magnet. And I like that it's the matte black packaging. I've gotten more into Tom Ford this year and I saw that and I was like, it was so expensive. I told my husband, I was like, I just wanna, see if it smells good. So he bought me a small thing of it because if I love it, then he'll buy me a bigger one. But I do actually kind of love it. It smells so good. So, so good. Okie dokie. Next up is a gift from my husband. And that is the Dyson Supersonic. This is the hair dryer. So this is just the regular hair dryer. So it has the different nozzles to change the flow of the hair. And then it also comes with a comb and a brush. I haven't taken it out of the box yet because I was scared if I take it out, I won't be able to get it back in. And this is going home because um, you'll see my other gift and you'll understand why. Um, so, ah, 
It has a comb and a round brush in here. And then the, I'm not gonna sit here and try to take all this out, but this is the Dyson hairdryer box. This thing is heavy, like super duper heavy. Like the box is like, it's really weird. Like the cardboard that they used is good, high quality cardboard. Do you ever hear people say that? I'm saying it in case no one else does. Because sometimes it's the little extra touches like that that make it feel even more bougie, you know? So, my husband, I have been talking about getting one of these forever. And I, I'm weird about buying stuff. Like, I'll spend the money on certain things, but other things not so much. That's what it looks like. Isn't that cute? And I love pink, so I'm excited. So, you've got the diffuser, different um, attachments. The cord is nice and thick. So, yeah, I'm excited to play with that. But that was from my husband. And then last but not least is the big gift from my children. So they went in together to purchase this for me because I had talked about wanting to get the air wrap, but I was like, I'm not gonna get it till after Christmas and whenever it goes back on sale at either Sephora or Ulta where I can get the points. So my kids love me and they bought me the Dyson Airwrap Complete Kit. So this has all of the nozzles with it. So it's got the half inch air wrap barrels, the one sixth air wrap barrels, three different brush heads. And this also works as a blow dryer too. So it has the nice fancy case. I don't know what I just dropped. But this is the nice fancy case, so for traveling. But I mean, if you were flying somewhere, I wouldn't travel with this because you'd, your luggage would be so heavy. So it's got like a little protector thing. And then there is a QR code that you can scan that tells you how to use the air wrap. Again, that's like super high quality cardboard. And then when you look on the inside, this is what it looks like. So the air wrap has a blow dryer attachment. I had, oh, it's four different curling heads. That's cool. Four different curling heads and then three different brush attachments, which you can blow dry or style your hair with these at the same time. And then the little air wrap handle itself. I can't wait to play with this and it's again in the pink because I am obsessed with pink. So I am super excited to play with these and you're like, Betsy, why do you need a hair dryer and a hair dryer? Because the air wrap does dry your hair. Well, typically most of my hair styling equipment stays up here, which is where I work. And I do keep a blow dryer at home. So the big blow dryer is going home so I can use it there after I get out of the shower and then the air wrap is staying here so I can do my hair and stuff before videos. Because typically, I'm lazy, or at least sometimes lazy, where I'm not gonna do my hair at home. I ain't got time for that. Uh, I mean, for the most part, if I'm at home, I wanna spend it with my husband and my kids. And I only do my hair if I'm filming, or if I have something or somewhere to go. So, I'm super excited for this. And if I love these as much as I would think I am, then whenever the Sephora Spring Sale comes around, I want, or the Ulta Spring Sale or whatever, I want to purchase the straightener. Because the idea of having a cordless straightener, that excites me. So, again, I can't wait to play. So, my family, if you're watching, and I know some of you are, I wanted to make sure to say a big thank you. I don't know what I have done. I'm not gonna cry, but I don't know what I've done to deserve a family like you. My kids, my mother and father-in-law, my sister-in-law, y'all are all absolutely amazing and I cannot thank you enough. And I love you each more than you could possibly know. But yeah, 
there's a lot of fun things to play with and I'm gonna end it there so I don't cry. But yeah, Dyson. It's one of those things like I kept talking about purchasing and purchasing like before I end this, so I'm gonna bring this up. But I, it's one of those kinds of things that I kept talking about purchasing and purchasing. Like I have no issue spending money on makeup. But when it comes to other things that are more expensive, um, I, I don't buy a lot. Um, I'm not very good at doing my hair, so that's not one of those things that I typically do a lot with, you know what I mean? So I'm hoping that this helps, and again, you know, I'm happy for, <laughs> more than happy for my family. So I guess that's it, so we'll see y'all later. Uh, I'm still posting every day in December, just because there's so much content and so much new stuff, but I guess that's it, we'll see y'all later. Bye.